Hey, everybody. Is that what you're going to wear? Philosophy, <laughs> <laughs> douchebag. We are going to talk about a video that Jason showed me today. That is, we think... The awesomest video of the 4th of July ever. Yeah, definitely. All American Boy by Steve Grant. They say that this, is, this guy is the first out country artist, but I watch this video and I don't really particularly think it's that country. Like, I disagree. I hate country music and nothing about it bothered me. Like it was, he had like, he's piano player. And so like that was really strong yeah. and it wasn't particularly twangy guitars. There wasn't really a draw There's... in his voice, but I mean, I can get that it's, it's it feels sort of like Southern rock, like there's a little Aerosmith or, yes. or, or, you know, Leonard there's Skinner country, or something. There's, there's country rock. There's yeah. country rock in there. Yeah, but like even country rock, like the Eagles makes me barf. And so I, the fact that I don't, that I like this song, I don't think it's particularly country. What I like about it is that it's, I mean, it's like gay theme, but nothing about it seems like forced. Forced, yeah. I feel like it's not contrived. I feel like it's from the heart and it's genuine. A, a, a woman singer could cover this and it'd just be the same thing. Right. Like about a guy that who wasn't paying attention, but in this case, it's just another guy going after right. another guy. Right. And can a guy just go after another guy? And... Absolutely. I really like the look of this video. I mean, it had like this sort of magenta, like it was shot on eight millimeter in the 60s, only it's got clear. The, the dusty look. Yeah, it's really summery and warm. Yes. And like, again, it's genuine. It feels really like natural. And he's like a really good actor because he plays and like, there's like there's, himself. Yeah, there's Americana, like all this Americana in it. Like right, the whiskey, whiskey and the convertible and a little bit smoking, which swimming like, hole smoking. Yeah, whatever. It's, but like, yeah, I get it. American flag, which is like over the top, but you know. Yeah, well, like, you know. Some some of the lyrics are, you know, 4th of July. Right, right. I feel like there was genuine pathos at the end, too, when he doesn't get the guy, but you know. But the guy still wants to be friends. Exactly, exactly. <laughs> it's still, it's really cool. I, again, it's a realistic ending. I mean, I think that, you know, he's sending a message that, that people in his generation just don't, I mean, like, they don't care. They're not, you know, mortally offended by this guy hit on me or whatever. Right, like, the dude's the, able to the guy, like, sort of yeah, shake like, it off and be like, hey, I'm straight, you know, but, you know, thanks, bro. You can still be my friend, you know. I believe it's thanks, bro. Bro. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. Thanks, bro. You okay? Bring yeah. over some whiskey. We'll still hang out. So but... the other thing that's significant about this guy, which I thought was really cool in reading about it, is that like he literally at this point doesn't even have a record contract or management. Like he like made this. Nor song... should he. <laughs> you don't think? Go independent. Oh, there you go, man. That's... It can, it can happen. It's the 21st century. There's yeah, all sorts of ways to get out there. As as this is showing, it's like exploding all over the internet. You know, like I would be shocked if this guy doesn't end up with at least management. Right. He's got to have a manager to help him out with this stuff. But like, so yeah, he, is... he like he literally like released this like July 2nd or mm -hmm. 3rd, and it like blew up over the 4th. Yeah. And then like Lance Bass re retweeted him. John mm -hmm. Barrowman retweeted him. When I saw it on the fourth, it was like at eighty thousand views, and right. now it's up at like over three hundred thousand views. Yeah, no, so it's crazy. It's and I, blowing up. I had a couple of friends that posted it on Facebook. That's right. And, and so yeah, so I had kind of seen it, but I didn't. I didn't. I was like, oh yeah, okay, some cute little guy that Jason wants me to watch. I didn't really watch it until he made me watch it today. So I really enjoyed it, and I mean, I think that you know. I'd like to see where this kid goes. I mean, I'd, I'd like to see, I'm assuming he doesn't have an album recorded yet or he probably would have talked about it a little bit. So I'd like to see what happens from here. Right. He is on Bandcamp and Facebook and it's um, facebook.com slash Steve Grand artist. artist. And then um, I think it's stevegrand.bandcamp.com. Download the song, donate what Download, you feel is yeah. right. Watch the video and leave a response down below and tell us what you think because we think this guy's awesome and we think he's going somewhere. I would actually more? say that he's our very first ever gay to watch. We're going to do a new segment about gays to watch and I think I, my, I vote that he's our first. He's my country prince. <laughs> <laughs> Suck on that Tyler Oakley. Screw that whoever that guy is. This, Dr. Hayes. Yes. yes. This is the real. This is the real country prince. Gay country prince. Suck on that Tyler. Yes. Okay, that's it. Yeah. That's all I had. That's all I had. Yeah? It's hot. Thanks, guys. What? You're, you're going to be known as the dude that just thinks everybody's hot. I do think everyone's hot. <laughs> I think he's really hot. <laughs>